Happy birthday to you. I was just being an idiot. Hit a soccer ball. Oh. <laughs> okay, uh, Ms. Robitaille, I'm sorry for your son's behavior. Jevin, <laughs> stop complaining. You're probably going to die. It's in your <laughs> DNA. It keeps you alive. <laughs> Seriously? You guys thought that was me sleeping? First of all, I get up early. This guy is lazy, still in bed. Second of all, I'm never gonna enter the vlog how you think I'm gonna enter the vlog, okay? I'm unpredictable. Okay, just did some treatment, ultrasound on my leg at the doctor's office. Guys, you heard me complain about the heat all summer. Now it's getting to my favorite time of the year. The fall, the autumn, whatever you want to call it, where it starts to get cooler and it's sweatshirt weather. This is my favorite time of year. I love this gray overcast weather. Look at how beautiful it is. Just got some good editing in at the old Sweet 21. I will tell you what, making a feature length film is quite a process. Now, right now I'm going to one of our lunch sponsors to give them some tickets for the game tomorrow. Hello, servus. Hi. We have uh, two tickets for the Unicorns game tomorrow. Okay. Yeah, for you guys. So oh, whoever wants them. Yeah, for Thanks. the game tomorrow at uh, okay. five. Yeah. Good. Thank you guys for everything. Yeah. Doing, Doing okay. Good. Yeah, I'm actually not going to play tomorrow. Rest. Got a little injury. Okay. But, uh, we have playoffs in two weeks. So. Okay. Good. Yeah. So okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. All right. We'll good. see you guys. Thank you. See you. Bye. Cheers. Those guys are the homies at Alt Hall. All of our restaurant sponsors are so, so cool to us and give us awesome, awesome food. It's a pretty good setup. And speaking of restaurant sponsors, we are going to the Bells Barcasa right now for some lunch. And look what just happened. I just cracked my phone. I just dropped it. Mm. Sitting outside the bus park house waiting for the guys. I'm just pretty upset about my cracked phone. I was just being an idiot. You guys like my phone background? My Aunt Helene painted this and I think it's really, really cool. Sweet. But now my phone's broken. That's what I get for not having it in a case, but it just feels so much cooler outside of a case. the memo for the unicorn sweatshirts all these guys are matching because uh huh I just dropped my phone bro. now that is a good meal that is a good friend and that is a straight up idiot. The mama. <laughs> talking about my mama? She, she watched it. Yeah, oh, she's gonna watch. Wow, say sorry. Sorry, mama. No, my mom. Oh. Say sorry, Mrs. Alf. Sorry, Mrs. Alf. Miss Alf. Hey, uh, Mrs. Robitaille, I'm sorry for your son's behavior. Uh, I know you raised him better than this. Seven inch screen TV, got the staircase going up to the bedroom. It's my yeah. lounge. But y'all get the fuck out. <laughs> We're having a 
driving a car in Schwabish Hall. Just driving a car in Schwabish Hall. We all got seatbelts on. Did you turn the heat on? I didn't touch it. It's so hot right now. Do you feel it? Yeah, it's on. It's the so heat hot. is on full blast. FB. Did you do that, Kim? Yeah. Did you really? Did you actually? I feel like you leaned up here while I was distracted and you did it. The classic Kim move. See you guys later. Ah, I am here at our practice field. Friday evening, we've got a game tomorrow. I'm here early to practice to get some physio treatment on my poor little calf, trying to get healed up for playoffs in two weeks. So tomorrow I will not be playing. And I always feel very badly when people come to the game and I'm not playing and after the game they say, oh, I drove 200 kilometers or three hours or something to the game to see you play and I wasn't playing. So I always feel very badly about that. So I hope that doesn't happen tomorrow because I'm not playing, um, but I will be playing in the playoffs. Knock on wood. talked about this before, a cool thing about the Unicorns is a lot of the senior players will coach some of the youth teams and we've got a lot of good coaches and then uh, we actually needed some more and so we got a couple bad coaches also, so Heem coaches the U17. I'm actually one of the bad coaches, that's probably bad. No, you're a great coach, I'm just kidding. You see how close I'm starting to get already? I want you to get as, I want you to get as close to him as fast as possible, you know? Close in that space, all right? And then when you get to him, when he, suffers, when he breaks down, you break down. All right, on you. On you, machine. There you go, much better. Much better. Tag him off, tag him off. Good stuff, Coach Wilson. So I've got to uh, wear this compression sleeve to keep compression on my hurt calf. And it's basically like this thing that mostly older people wear. Like, everybody's grandma wears these things, basically. And now me. So people are making fun of me a lot. But it's really tight, and it gives me good compression, and it helps my body heal. I just look like I'm 90 years old, from the knee down. And just like that, we got the compression, and we've got the swaggy, elderly person look, style going on here. This is a European in his natural habitat with a soccer ball. Oh! <laughs> See, he's just kicking in the face. Kitty mini trying to kick a soccer ball in my face. I'm sorry. Uh, I'm that's sorry, right, man. I forgive you. I'm sorry, man. I forgive you. <laughs> my nose is going to start gushing blood. Good thing I'm out already. This is the guy, everybody. This is the guy who said my video sucked. That that just uh, breath of fresh air, German honesty. I love it. Which ones didn't you like? The one with the book. No, the one where I took the German culture and the quiz. The next one, what was that? You yeah, liked that. The one with the book. Then like. The other one with the book. I think that's a pattern. <laughs> he doesn't like books. He can't read. Yeah, I, can't read. <laughs> I, like, I like Roby. Danny got you. You can't read, just like Gary and Roby. <laughs> Did you like my personal space video? I loved it. Oh, it thanks, funny. Deanna. That That's a real friend, Deanna. Deanna's the one who gave me the uh, hand sanitizer that everybody still got mad at. Yeah. <laughs> Classic. Classic. You don't care about the environment, Deanna. Oh, if stop complaining, you're probably gonna die. It's in your DNA. It keeps you alive. Yeah, it keeps you alive. Complaining keeps you alive. You need food, water, shelter, and the ability to complain. Yeah. Those are the essentials to life for a German. <laughs> And beer. Okay, Schmo. Not and beer is like beer and then like beer. <laughs> beer first. It's the first priority. <laughs> Yeah.
Hey, don't forget. <laughs> don't forget. If anybody has any questions about Kids Day, come talk to me after to make sure that's all organized and good. Good. All right. Go. All right. Ready, Eddie? Come on.